It's a Williams hydraulic pump. It's a gear pump. It has, it's a counter clockwise rotation. I want to make it clockwise. Um, and you have to take it apart and flip a few things around. I wanted to videotape it so I don't forget what I did to it. Gives you the directions to do it, which I think it makes it sound harder than it is, because I know there ain't that much to it. But anyhow, I already broke these. These these are pretty tight. Um, I'm not sure how many gallons this is per minute, but it took a good. Um, pressure to get them bolts out of there. I think it was 100 foot-pounds. Anyhow. And I had to rig up a T50 socket. Torque socket. It seems like T50 is a little sloppy, but that's what they said it takes. Anyhow, yeah, they want you to put a mark already got marked across here straight up I guess I don't know why that it's not going to line up again but I guess it's to make sure it doesn't line up again to make sure you get it on right your ports uh, intake ports are bigger and right now it's there on both the same sides smaller um, outlet ports on this side and when I'm what it when it's all said and done this will be just the opposite be uh, intake here intake here so There's not a whole lot to that. It's a brand new pump. It's never been used. As far as I know, anyway. It looks brand new. And then this part comes off. It's a lunamen. This is all lunamen. Except for the, um, the goldish parts. They're steel, and that gold on them is an, is an iodized, some kind of iodized solution. Yeah, there's a ring there too, a little ring. Looks like a pretty good pump, except for being made out of aluminum. Anyhow, a lot of little parts to it. Also, then seals that look like especially well, maybe not. That might be just a. Now that's a specialty seal. It'd be hard to get them seals. You'd have to go to the company. Usually they're just O-rings, but... So... Wow, these are just... Basically two separate parts. Just a little plastic thing holding them together.
trying to keep these oriented so I know where which came out of which which this don't look like it's going to be too difficult and I can go in one spot hmm. now so basically hmm. just turn that 180 degrees which I do not see oh yes I see that side yeah that side is what's important now I'm sure it just all goes back together so now put this stuff back in and then this will go this way That should be it, except for this collar. Yeah, that just lines up with itself. Okay, so this line now, supposedly, this line here is the complete opposite, which is over there, which makes sense. Of course, you're telling me seal side up. The seal stayed in there, so they're wrong about that. And the line is complete opposite. So, no. no alignment pins on these. So don't need it. The ports in them are the same side size on the inside. It's the outside that's different. That don't make sense. For that to go back on that way. I supposed to switch that I don't think I was supposed to switch that last one hmm I don't see how that changes that I do not see how that changes anything so I'm supposed to do something different with this. Pick up the rear bearing block 
with the seal side up and with the open side of the E seal facing the reorient intake side. I do not see what that changed at all. Because That sucks it in. Oh, it's imp I wouldn't have did this to it. Maybe I would. No, that's exactly the same. It might be different. I don't know if that's going to matter a whole lot. There is a difference there, definitely. So, I got it all screwed up. Well, it's a good thing to mark it. I can see that. That's the way it was. Now, I cannot see taking it and flipping it. But that's a possibility. Oh, what did that do? Did you tell you to flip it? Let's see, pick up the rear bearing block with seal side up. They both have seals on it. Marker line is now on this side of the pump. Hmm. They are telling me to flip it. flip it so that the mark line is now on the exact opposite side of the pump from its original position. This will keep the drive gears and idler gear in the same respective gear pocket. Okay, that's why you got to read the directions the whole way through. So yes, just flip it. Same gear pocket. Now it makes more sense.
Yes, now it looks different. And this goes back on the same way. Now it makes more sense. And that's it. Now I got a small side, big side, big side, small side. I just gotta twerk it down, try it out.